What's your story? What's your plan? You could do anything you want to do if you put your mind to it. I mean, when I first got, when I first told people that I was going to do a welding course at the Dundee College, I got laughed at. And not one single person thought that I was going to do it. Not one. Hi, my name's Jade Anderson and I'm a fabricator welder. I left it all down to luck. Um, basically, I wasn't sure where my life was going and I had no idea what I wanted to do career-wise. So I went to college and picked up the college book that had like all their courses on it and I just flipped through it and whatever it landed on I was going to do and it landed on welding. So I was like, oh, right, I'll just go through with it, see what happens. And as soon as I picked up a welder, I was like, this is so much fun. Like, I, I was just good at it. I do get a big sense of satisfaction when I finish building something, because I'm, I'm very particular and very work proud. So, like, I have to do a good job and I make sure that I do a really good job of it. So when I'm finished, I can stand back and look at it and be like, yeah, I made that. Like, at Foodmec, we make lots of machines for lots of food companies. And, like, when I'm in Tesco and, say, I'm on the ice cream aisle, Mackey's stands out. I always say to myself, I made machines for them. I could have helped make that ice cream. The good thing about this trade is you need help from everyone and everyone's usually happy to help you. I wouldn't be where I am today if it wasn't for half the people that I've met willing to help us and get us through and teach, teach me. It's just, it's good knowing that you've got help there when you need it. Being a female in this industry wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. Like, I knew it was going to be difficult and I knew I was going to come across a lot of people looking down on me, but I've just managed to prove them all wrong. Like, it doesn't matter if you're male or female, I'm still good enough to do the job. Um, and once I've proved myself to them, they've just totally overlooked the fact that I'm a girl. Um, and being young as well, like, it's not, like, although trades are full of older people, there's still some younger people that the older people take on, take them on and give them their wisdom and it's just, every, you're always learning. Um, I don't see being a girl in the trade as a problem and everyone I've worked with, they don't see it as a problem either anymore.